The general equation of photosynthesis is 6 CO2 plus 6 H2O with the help of light yields C6H12O6 plus 6O2. This basically means water plus carbon dioxide plus sunlight produces glucose and oxygen. ATP is made in photosynthesis through chemiosmosis and NADPH is made through the NADP plus reductase. Chlorophyll is a green pigment found in the chloroplasts of algae and plant cells. Grana is the stacks of thylakoids embedded in the stroma of a chloroplast. The structure of a chloroplast contains the stroma, which is the gel-like substance that holds all of the contents in place. The thylakoid, where most of the reactions take place. The thylakoid membrane is a double membrane with a phospholipid bilayer membrane. The light reaction takes place in the thylakoid membrane in the Kelvin cycle. Dark reaction takes place in the stroma. Photosystem 2 is the first integral protein in the light-dependent reactions of photosynthesis. Photosystem 1 is the second integral protein that the electrons pass through. Both photosystems absorb photons of light to power the electrons to keep moving through the electron transport chain. The NADP plus reductase and the ATP synthase are more integral proteins on the thylakoid membrane. When the electrons pass through the NADP plus reductase, the energy powered in the electrons gives power to turn NADP plus into NADPH. The same process happens when the electrons move through the ATP synthase. This gives the power to make ADP into ATP. The process of the light reaction begins when water enters the thylakoid membrane and it splits into oxygen, hydrogen, and electrons. Oxygen passes through the thylakoid membrane and goes out through the stomata. Electrons travel through photosystem 2 and are charged with energy. As they move along the electron transport chain, they actively pull hydrogen into the lumen. The electrons then go through photosystem 1, are charged more, and go through the small ETC. They go through the NADP plus reductase and create NADPH. The hydrogen goes through the ATP synthase to create ATP. The ATP and the NADPH now go to the Calvin cycle. Chlorophyll A is a specific form of chlorophyll used in photosynthesis. It absorbs most energy from the wavelengths of violet, blue, and orange red light. Chlorophyll B is a form of chlorophyll used in photosynthesis. It helps in photosynthesis by absorbing light energy. Its color is yellow and it primarily absorbs blue light. Cratinoids are pigments that are used in photosynthesis that absorb red, yellow, and orange light wavelengths. Cratinoids and chlorophyll B transfer their light energy to chlorophyll A. ATP and NADPH created in the light reactions travels through the Calvin cycle. This is the Calvin cycle. Also known as the light independent reactions, it happens in the stroma of a chloroplast. Rubisco is an enzyme that combines carbon with a 5 carbon compound to create a 6 carbon molecule. So, in the Kelvin cycle, 3CO2 enters and combines with 3RUBP, creating the 6 carbon molecule. This 6 carbon molecule is split into two 3 carbon molecules and one phosphate molecule called phosphoglycerate, or PGA. We now have 6 PGA molecules. Each PGA gets a phosphate from ATP, reducing the ATP to ADP. We now have 6 biphosphoglycerates. Now, NADPH comes and takes a phosphate from each biphosphoglycerate. We now have six glyceraldehyde-3 phosphates, also known as G3P and PGAL. The ADP and NADP plus go back to the light reaction. So the fate is one G3P leaves and the other five convert back to RUBP with the help of ATP. G3P is prime in the synthesis of fats, proteins, and carbohydrates. The effect that temperature has on the rate of photosynthesis is as temperature increases to around 25 degrees Celsius, photosynthesis is at its highest rate of production. 
As the temperature increases past that point, the production slows and slows to a complete halt. No photosynthesis is taking place. This happens because the stomata closes due to the heat. The rate of photosynthesis increases as the intensity of light increases until it meets its maximum amount. And that is photosynthesis.